Picture this. A laser weapon that can fire beams continuously, without any interruptions, with the ability to unleash limitless energy at the speed of light. This isn't the script of a Hollywood blockbuster. It's a groundbreaking development announced by Chinese military scientists. Chinese military has reportedly developed new technology that improves the performance of high-energy laser systems. This insane discovery could transform the very nature of warfare, offering extended engagement times, greater range and damage, and cost-effective advantages. China already has a lead over the United States in some aspects, but Chinese military analysts want China to do more in the field of laser weapons. Today's episode will cover the insane Chinese laser weapon that has never been seen before. Chinese military scientists have just unveiled a groundbreaking development in laser weapon technology, promising the limitless operation of high-energy lasers without any pesky waste heat buildup. Imagine having the power to shoot laser beams continuously, indefinitely, without any interruptions. Directed energy weapons like high-energy lasers could be a game-changer in future wars. Sounds like science fiction, doesn't it? Well, it's not. According to researchers at the National University of Defense Technology in Changsha, Human Province, they've achieved this game-changing feat by eliminating the harmful heat generated during high-energy laser operation. This technological leap is a game-changer for laser weapon systems. It's like a breath of fresh air in a scorching desert, and the implications are immense. But how do they manage to pull off such a feat? It's like finding a key to a door that's been locked for years. Their innovative cooling system employs advanced structures and optimized gas flow to whisk away the heat generated inside the laser weapon. Not only does it reduce turbulence and vibration, but it also improves the cleanliness of mirrors, which is a big deal when it comes to high-energy lasers. This technology is not just a technological feat, it's a potential game-changer in warfare. Imagine lasers that can engage for longer, cover more ground, cause greater damage, and cost less in terms of logistics. This could redefine the face of battle in the most unexpected way. Now let's take a step back and consider how revolutionary this really is. For over 60 years, scientists and researchers around the world have been on a quest to transition from kinetic energy to laser energy, the dream, to project energy at the speed of light turning laser beams into what they call death rays that can instantly take down targets. Unfortunately, that dream has remained elusive, and the application of high-energy laser systems has largely been a non-starter. But here, in the heart of China, a breakthrough is emerging. It's like finally discovering the hidden path to a treasure trove of possibilities. The United States has seen its fair share of attempts in this field too. They've embarked on projects like the Navy Advanced Chemical Laser, the Middle Infrared Advanced Chemical Laser, the Tactical High Energy Laser, the Space-Based Laser, and the Airborne Laser. These projects, in various ways, showed promise, with some even managing to shoot down missiles and flying targets. But here's the catch. These projects were all canceled. Why? You ask. Well, according to the scientists, it's not just about the size and weight of the lasers. The real reason lies in their destructive power falling short of expectations. These weapons had a limited effective range of just a few kilometers. To really pack a punch, they needed longer continuous operation times. So, let's dive a bit deeper into how lasers work. Inside a laser weapon, a high-energy beam is created through a process called stimulated emission. It's like a dance of atoms and molecules as they get excited in a game medium, a crystal or gas, and then return to their ground state, emitting photons along the way. These photons are then amplified to create a powerful laser beam. Now, this beam needs careful control, which involves mirrors and lenses to guide it. However, as this laser beam journeys through the air, it starts to heat up the gas around it. This heating causes the gas to expand and creates a turbulent flow, like a stormy sea, disturbing the beam's path. This turbulence can scatter and distort the beam, making it less effective and precise. Moreover, the heated gas can lead to the mirrors and lenses becoming contaminated, which is bad news for the laser's performance and lifespan. Think of it as dust settling on your glasses. It impairs your vision. In some cases, it's not just dust. It's larger pollutant particles, like boulders on your path. 
They can even cause damage, cracking those precious mirrors and lenses. It's like trying to take a clear picture through a muddy lens. These challenges have plagued laser weapons for years, but here's where China scientists claim they cracked the code. Yuan Shengfu's team has devised an internal beam path conditioner, a system that sends gas through the weapon to sweep away waste heat and boost gas cleanliness. It's like having a vacuum cleaner for your laser weapon, ensuring it stays efficient. This system is designed to be compact and efficient, with a focus on optimizing gas flow while minimizing its size and weight. Imagine a device that does its job effectively without being bulky and cumbersome. The system includes various components, like an air source to supply clean, dry air, a heat exchanger to cool the air down, a gas flow control system, and a gas injection or suction system. The air source acts like a refreshing breeze on a hot summer day, ensuring the air is crisp and dry before it goes through the system. Then the gas flow control system plays the role of a conductor, making sure the gas flows at the right temperature and for the right amount of time. It's all about achieving those quasi-static small aberrations. The gas injection or suction system is like a well-timed performer, injecting gas into the system when needed and whisking it away after its task is complete. Of course, creating this system wasn't a walk in the park. The scientists had to tackle several technical and practical challenges along the way. Ensuring the gas flow cools and cleans effectively was a tricky task. It required careful design and rigorous testing of both the gas flow control and injection or suction systems. They had to make sure that the system was not just effective, but also practical for real-world applications. This called for creative designs and innovative solutions like advanced pneumatic structures and streamlined pipelines. It's like piecing together a complex puzzle where every part had to fit just right. But as with any innovation, there are challenges to overcome. Even this advanced cooling system isn't without its hiccups. For example, blowing gas through the internal beam path can create turbulence and vibration, affecting the beam's stability and quality. It's like sailing through choppy waters when you'd rather have a smooth voyage. The journey to perfection is never easy, but the results are certainly worth it. The implications of this breakthrough are far-reaching. China has been actively developing high-energy laser weapons with the ability to destroy or disable targets like drones, missiles, and aircraft. The speed at which these laser weapons can engage targets is breathtaking. Literally, it's the speed of light. They also promise to be more cost-effective than traditional missile-based systems, sparing the expense of expensive munitions and allowing for quick recharges. This technology could revolutionize warfare as we know it. Imagine the ability to disrupt enemy communications, navigation, and surveillance capabilities, and even gain a strategic edge in space-based conflicts. It's a future that's now closer than ever, with much about the insane Chinese laser weapon that has never been seen before covered. It is time to wrap this one up. If you have any topics in mind, comment below and we will cover them for you. As always, subscribe to never miss out. This is Race to Space, and we will see you in the next one.